day, everybody. Today we're making a taco salad. It's a really easy, fast dinner. I just got home from work, threw this all together, all the prep anyways, in about less than 10 minutes, probably five actually. Um, to do this, I have a pound and a third of beef because that's what normally comes in in the store these days. I have a pretty good size onion that's chopped up. I have garlic, cheese, lettuce, some crushed up Doritos, it makes it really good. Jalapenos, this is just some onions and cilantro mixed together, regular cilantro. I've got avocados, I've got chili powder, cumin, Mexican oregano. There is a big difference between Mexican oregano and Middle Eastern oregano. If you're going to do a lot of Mexican cooking, I'd highly suggest getting some of this. There, it, you will notice a difference. It's, it's worth the money. Um, it's not that expensive. And then some sour cream. So I've just turned this on, our beef. I'm going to add a little bit of this Mexican oregano. Maybe a teaspoon. I've got some cumin. Another teaspoon or so. This is chili powder. Maybe a tablespoon or two of the chili powder. I'm just going to start mixing this up. Oh no. You do kind of want to mix this up pretty well just to get those flavors dispersed. Once it gets to cooking, it'll all work out, but it's nice to get it mixed around a little bit. You definitely want to cook this all the way through. Whenever you get minced meat at the, the grocery store, it's, um, I, I wouldn't eat it anything less than well done. <laughs> You just, you just never know. If you go to a butcher and they butcher it th themselves right in front of you, that's another story. Or if you bring home some meat yourself and you grind it yourself, then you can have it any way you want. Oh. This is about two cloves of garlic. I forgot to put that in earlier, but that's all right. It'll work itself out. All right, well, the meat's done and it's ready to go. So my lovely assistant here is gonna show you how to put this together. Only because I'm gonna gnaw his arm off if I don't get up here. So there's a specific way that I like to make it. I always start with the meat because that helps to melt the cheese. So I'll start with that, then put a little bit of cheese on. That's a little for me. Uh, then we're gonna go with our main ingredient, which is the lettuce, because it is a taco salad, by the way. Uh, then we like cilantro, and we follow it off with the all-important crushed Doritos. Kind of like having a crispy taco without all the mess. It's going to break apart on you anyways, so really what you're doing is you're building a taco backwards here. But it works, trust us on this. There's something about the Doritos that just make it really, really good. Taco sauce, maybe? Yeah. Ooh, my favorite part. Mm. I'm a huge fan of taco sauce. Let's give that a try. Yeah. So there's the taco salad. Now for the fun part, digging in and getting the right proportions on each forkful. Mm. How's it taste? It tastes good, if it needs more cheese. You can never have too much cheese, right? So give this one a try and let us know what you think down in the comments. Y'all have fun out there, be kind to each other, and we'll see you next time. Thanks.